Hi guys, this is your boy Emmanuel Ajmaibadu. Go on YouTube and subscribe to Sahara Football. Cheers. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As usual, I am your host, Selassie Fiawe. Uh, looking to recover from that uh, unfortunate exit from a possibility of qualifying for the african cup of nations breaking news is that the ghana black stars yes uh, the players uh, uh, more of them are leaving four of them have been confirmed uh, to leave camp tomorrow as we prepare for that game between ghana and niger we'll be looking at the reason why jordan ayuapil fatau ishahaku uh, gideon mensa and also Ali said who suffered injuries will not probably be in action on Monday. It was expected. There's no point in the game. So why would they stay and stick around? We'll be talking about it. We'll look at the itinerary for the pre-match press conference for the Ghana Black Stars as well as they prepare to face Niger in the final game. Niger have a chance to qualify. They will need a favor, however, uh, from the other end. Uh, Sudan just need a draw and they are through to the next African Cup of Nations against opponents like Angola. Who are looking to improve uh, the uh, FIFA rankings? I don't think there will be any let up, and uh, the competitiveness will remain the same. It will be interesting to see how things uh, will look at all that today. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Click on that notification bell to get more updates. We'll jump right into it and start off from the four injured players. Four players will not be available: Jordan Ayew, uh, Gideon Mensa, Abdul Fatau, Ishahaku. Uh, they have been ruled out of uh, the uh, forthcoming African Cup of Nations qualifier against uh, Niger due to injuries. Now, uh, Ali Duseidu and Gideon Mensah, who had to pass a late fitness test for the Angola game, have been ruled out after further post-game medical assessment. Uh, reviewed findings that make them unfit for selection. And now Jordan Ayu and Abdul Fatah Wishaku sustained injuries during the Angola match. I think Ishaku was substituted during that game. Ayu uh, completed the game. MRI scans in Accra revealed significant issues with his knee. Ishaku was substituted in the first half due to injury. Now, following consultations between the Black Stars medical team, head uh, Dr. Prince Pambo and uh, Leicester City's medical team, Ayu and Ishaku will remain we will rejoin their clubs on Sunday uh, to begin rehabilitation. No surprises there. The point of the game is, is pointless now. We cannot qualify for the African Cup of Nations. What's the point of keeping the boys here? And it's fair enough. I understand it. It's, it's just unfortunate how things have turned out in the end. Ghana, uh, we're looking uh, to make history. We're looking to make the African Cup of Nations once again. Unfortunately, it did not happen. We did not win versus Angola. That meant that uh, that was the end of the road. And there have been a lot of inquisition. There have been a lot of queries into where it all went wrong. I think one thing we can all agree on is that uh, you can't keep doing the same thing and expecting a different result. We keep uh, chopping and changing. We keep pushing player selection onto the throat of coaches. We don't allow coaches to work. We don't hire the right men to be at the helm so many things that starts from the top and until those things are resolved i think uh, we will have to try to get back on track before the march international games the march ghana will be taking part in the world cup qualifiers so it'll be interesting to see how that one goes my next uh, update has to do with the black stars uh, uh, pre-match press conference it's not going to be something that will draw a crowd as it did for the sudan game so in my opinion i don't think tickets should be sold but that's my opinion let me know what you think in the comments box four players have been ruled out or Toado is set to face the media tomorrow at 4 p.m. 4.30 is the official training. Niger is 10 a.m. 10.30 official training. We'll be following all closely and bringing you all the updates here. The Black Stars are out of AFCON in case you needed reminding. And uh, we hope and wish that the World Cup uh, qualifiers would be a different story. Your thoughts now?